Hi, this is a quick tutorial showing you how to set up Studio One to work with Liquid Notes on a Mac. If there is no IAC bus installed on your computer, please watch our tutorial video about the installation of an IAC bus first. But now this is our song in Studio One and we want to work on it with Liquid Notes. In Studio One, we first have to create an external device. You only need to configure it once and from that point on, connections between Studio One and Liquid Notes can be established easily. Click on Studio One, Preferences and choose the tab External Devices. Click on Add and fill in the fields as needed. Then from the drop-down named Receive From, choose the first IAC bus, leave Send To on None, and make sure to choose the option Split Channels. Then click OK. Now we have to export the song as a MIDI file from Studio One. And then we're simply dragging the exported MIDI file onto the Liquid Notes window, like this. Next, the wizard opens and we choose Studio One as our sound output source. So the result of the track type analysis here is correct. And we click on Finish. Next, let's take a look at the instrument selection where we can find the output ports and output channels for each track. So for each track, we now have to assign each input channel in Studio One to the corresponding output channel in Liquid Notes. Simply put, the number of the input channel in Studio One has to match the number of the respective output channel in Liquid Notes. Liquid Notes automatically assigns the channel to the tracks in an ascending order. And that's how it should be configured in Studio One 2. Now select the virtual cable we just created in Studio One and do this for all instrumental tracks. As a result, track one should now be listening to channel one, track two to channel two, and so on and so on. And finally, we enable record for all tracks. And that's it. The connection has been established. And when you play the song from Liquid Notes, you'll hear it through Studio One now. Thanks for watching.